Not long after that, in 1974, I think it was, I was introduced to John Owen. I stayed for about a year or so in the manse of uh, Jeffrey Thomas, uh, the Reformed Baptist preacher in Alfred Place in Aberystwyth, where he has been now for almost 45 years. And I was uh, a young Christian. I'd only been converted a couple of years, and I was living in his uh, manse on the third floor, and he decided that one of the things that I needed most was to get up early, and I think it was around five o'clock in the morning, and uh, the two of us would drink uh, very strong coffee, black, no sugar, and we read together volume seven of John Owen on spiritual mindedness. Uh, John Owen can be prolix. Uh, John Owen believed in the philosophy, why say something in a hundred words when you can take a thousand? <laughs> and I remember writing in the margins of my volume seven of John Owen little notes at five or five thirty in the morning, incomprehensible notes now as I go back and look at them. But I do remember this one statement that John Owen made. Actually, it was a question. What do you think about when you're not thinking about anything in particular? What do you think about when you're not thinking about anything in particular? What is the default setting of your mind? What do you revert to when you're not being forced to go in a certain direction? And that, John Owen says, is the indicator of your spiritual mindedness. It is the indicator of your holiness. 